world to the finely tuned bodies of 007's world. Over the last 20 years, James Bond movies have become the longest running success story in cinema history, featuring some of the world's most beautiful women from exotic, faraway places. But the next one, with Roger Moore again taking over from Sean Connery, will feature a girl all the way from Briley Hill in the Black Country. Doug Carnegie now reports. For a model only 18 years old, Paula Thomas's face and many of her other charming features are becoming better known by the week. But aside from the occasional page three spot and the super sore away what you may call it, she's been best known to the specialist readers of photography magazines. But in a few months, millions across the world will see her in the new James Bond movie, A View to a Kill, with superstar Roger Moore. <laughs> She beat hundreds of other girls to the part, which will probably be non-speaking. Pity, because she could do more in minutes to publicise the black country accent than Enoch and Eloy in a lifetime. How did she finally hear she'd got it? Well, it was just a lot of excitement. I had a phone call off my agent. She said, uh, you better sit down or get a stiff drink. <laughs> and I did sit down and she said, uh, they've just rang her from London and you've got the part. And the phone went up in the air. My mum thought I'd had a fit. <laughs> and then in the next five minutes, the whole of Pensnet knew about it. Um, and I just can't believe it. I still can't believe it now. A lot of people will think that models in Bond films come from Hampstead and Chelsea and places, but here's you from Broil Eel. I know. <laughs> uh, I think on the day, personality had a lot to do with it. Plus, he must have liked me, otherwise I wouldn't have got anywhere. But uh, I just can't get over it. I'm dying to meet the other girls, see what they're like, see if they're as down-to-earth as me, I hope they are. Um, and that's it, basically. I just can't wait to go on the 13th of August. Should be there. Uh, they're filming in Chateau Chantilly in France. Um, there's 14 girls going, only five British girls though. And I think there was a big selection they could have choose from. So I'm really lucky. Really what, lucky. Have, what have you been told about the part? Well, when, when I went for the dress rehearsal, they showed me what I was wearing and whatnot, and they just said, you know, that it's not going to be a very big part, which I expected. Um, but it's going to take, I think, at least a week. So uh, a bit of sunbathing and a bit of uh, <laughs> getting to know people should be great. If you had a speaking part, it would really put uh, Penn's net on the map. It would do, but uh, I don't know whether to do the Bond film any good. <laughs> Paula Thomas obviously stirred, but far from shaken, by her newfound fame. And I bet that's got a few of our male viewers all hot and bothered. A local lass there giving the exotic beauties a run 